The Everford is the ship with the ever unfortunate name. Not going forward, not going back, stuck until now. It's been freed, a hallelujah on Easter morning. For more than a month, the plight of the Everford has been the offshore entertainment at Downs Park in Pasadena, Maryland. Ah, there you go, Chesapeake Bay. What in the world happened? It's been the backdrop for fishing, dog walking, and what's this? Even a marriage proposal. Well, I knew the boat was stuck. I didn't know it was here. A less happy engagement happened between the Everford and the bottom of the Chesapeake Bay. The vessel carrying almost 5,000 containers drifted outside the shipping channel. I mean, how did they get off to the side like that and then get stopped? Just like, boom, that's it. We're here, 24 feet in the mud. To lighten the load, hundreds of containers came off in open water, a last resort kind of move. But getting the Ever Ford moving forward also took some tugging and digging and a higher power. See that moon? A rising tide lifted this boat. Evergreen has needed help floating their boats. Another vessel from the Taiwanese shipping giant got wedged a year ago across the Suez Canal in Egypt. Everything stopped. But no ship stoppers here in the Chesapeake, just around the bend from the port of Baltimore. This car carrier cruising on by. For weeks, all the bay's been a stage. The regulars around here, mere spectators. Everybody's talking about it. You go in the grocery store, and anything different on the ship? Because they know we walk down here. And I tell them, nope, not that I can see. Now the Everford will see itself out, have its exit. There goes the neighborhood, with never again views like this.